AT is Auckland Transport, the main mode of transport for Aucklanders and the government-run organisation that focuses on the travel of the people in Auckland. They own the buses, trains, ferries in Auckland. AT has been very helpful in my school career with getting me to and from school. It's helped thousands of other students in Auckland. Auckland Transport is very useful for a lot of social reasons as I use it to get to people's houses and from people's houses. But because it gets students around Auckland doesn't mean it's great or the students love it. I can't think of the last time I thought of a bus being reliable so I have to plan around it being late. With us hearing negative stuff about AT from our peers, we've asked several students questions on AT and how it has affected their views. Do you think there are enough buses and bus stops? I think there's enough bus stops, maybe not enough buses if you're not on time. I want the older bus to come like more frequently. I think often there are enough bus stops, but they're in the wrong areas. Do you think the buses are reliable? Do I think the buses are reliable? No, I think often they don't come on time. No. Why? Because they don't show up on time. More inconvenient than they are reliable. What do you think the biggest problem with buses are right now? I think often they leave before I've sat down, and I often fly to the back of the bus. I've been charged 12 bucks to go from North Shore to Vic Park. Um, the prices always change and fluctuate. Like, sometimes I'm waiting for the bus, bro, and I put my hand on, bro, and the bus driver just goes like this and just keeps on driving. All the, all the time when it says, like, not in service, bro, and, like, I'm waiting for an hour, and then they just, they, they change it, and they just drive off. Was it for the wrong route, and the driver was angry from as soon as I got off? Do you feel safe on the bus? I feel quite safe on the bus because there are security cameras. Oh hell yeah! Oh, definitely. Really <laughs> definitely. <laughs> yeah. How do you feel the buses could be improved anyway to make you happier? I think if they came on time and more reliable, that would be great. And um, yes, I think if it's going to be cheaper, that would be good. Uh, cleaner seats and on time. Need more, I reckon. More like just mm. not in the city. We interviewed our Travelwise teacher and asked him a few questions about Auckland Transport. Um, I'm Jared Huckley, I'm a maths teacher here at Springs and I work with the, um, the school's Travelwise uh, group. Would you say AT is reflected positively or negatively onto the students? Um, so the group I work with is it's pretty good because we have a liaison, a community liaison who uh, tries to help us out as much as it can and um, it's really good. Um, but the general student body probably gets not as good a vibe about that. Um, maybe some frustration around buses and, uh, and, and things not working as, as well as they'd like. What are some positives that AT do towards the students? Um, well, they, well they do advertise I think to, uh, to try to get people on public transport and, and things like that. There's some uh, movement around getting better cycle infrastructure for us with uh, connected paths and things like that, but that's, that's also a little bit slow moving at times. What do you think is the biggest problem with AT buses at the moment? Um, it's uh, here, uh, the frequency. Um, people want to be able to rely on, on getting to a bus uh, and, and not having to wait for too long. So, um, so getting that frequency up and I think uh, from what I've seen from students is they get a little frustrated with some of the drivers too, that they're a little bit grumpier than they need to be. How do you think AT could improve? Um, if, I think it's probably a wider council thing, is that they're, they're fitting amongst all the other departments. Is, um, is it slow moving for that reason? Is um, they, they have a great idea about uh, transport, um, but then there's some other departments getting in the way of that. Um, so I think it's probably a wider council issue. We tried to contact someone from AT. We got sent in a giant circle. With someone from the media team, then someone from the technical level with experience on AT and the actions they are doing. We ended up with a final link to the front page of AT saying that this would be enough to answer any of our questions. We gave up on contacting them and thought how since we are students and trying to contact someone, how a normal student would have problems contacting AT about a problem they have with the organisation. AT can improve itself through the negatives that the students have given throughout this film. 
We would like to see an improvement in AT's overall system, with big points being reliability, clear communication between AT and the students. AT needs to clean up the eggs, having a better image with the students and improving quality of life improvements, with an increase of reliability, consumer friendly practices like honesty and safety. Um, don't be shit. Thank you. <laughs> Y'all, the bad memories happened to the bus. Right, one time, one time for the one time. One time I was on the bus, right? The whole bus was empty. And I'm talking about ghost town empty, alright? Listen, this dude came with the bus. Looking like he's straight out of the crack den. I don't know where he came from, bro. And you know what? Dude sat right next to me. 